Hi there everybody, Gina and Fenway here. Do you ever find yourself getting nostalgic, reliving those glory days? I do that sometimes, thinking about all the good times you had when you were younger, hopeful, and not so jaded by life. The funny thing is that back in my glory days, I didn't have the love of Christ in my heart. So how can they truly be my glory days? There's a song by Bruce Springsteen called Glory Days. The chorus goes like this. Glory days, well, they'll pass you by. Now I think I'm going down to the well tonight and I'm gonna drink to get my fill. And I hope when I get old, I don't sit around thinking about it, but I probably will. Yeah, just sitting back trying to recapture a little of the glory of. Well, time slips away and leaves you with nothing, mister, but boring stories of glory days. The grass always seems greener on the other side, doesn't it? When we're young, we want to be more mature. And when we get to the winter season of our life, we wish we were young again. That's the humanness in all of us, but God always meets us where we are, no matter what season we're in. When I think of my own glory days now, I laugh because the life I have now with the love of Christ in my heart and all around me greatly surpasses any of the old glory days I may long for. The here and now is what God wants us to focus on and live out in his word and deed. Our true glory days will be when he comes back to this earth for us and we live alongside him in heaven forever. So make the most of the here and now. Don't waste your time on the past. Time should never be wasted. None of us know how much of it we have left. God has so much he wants to share with us if we fully engage ourselves in his presence, in his word, in it, and in our present. Psalm 1611 says, You make known to me the path of life. In your presence there is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. Thank you and God bless.